Hey guys, my name is Jazz and welcome to Jikoni Yetu. Today we're making some coconut matoke that I'm telling you, you're gonna love. We've all grown up eating matoke, so we probably don't like it that much, but this recipe, this one you're gonna have to try at home. I'm gonna start off with some corn oil, elianto, which I absolutely love because it's cholesterol free and suitable for all types of cooking. Just gonna pop that open. Next, I'm gonna add some onions. Give that a good start. When our onions are cooking, I'm gonna add a few spices in. I love cooking down my spices in the oil. It just extracts all of that yummy goodness. I'm also gonna add some garlic and ginger and some grated tomatoes. Give that a good stir. Next in, I'm gonna add my tomato paste. Stir it all together. I'm also adding some water into the saucepan just to create a nice stew. As that is cooking, I have my green bananas boiling for about 10 minutes, which is gonna make it easier for me to peel and chop without having sticky fingers. What we have here are potatoes, butternut and some sweet potatoes, and these are all going into our stew. Then we give that a good stir. Our bananas are almost ready, so we're just gonna remove them from the heat and peel. And there we have it, our bananas are nice and ready and they're ready to go into the pan. I'm also gonna add a pinch of salt. Some coconut cream. and some water. Give it a good stir. And now we're gonna let this cook for about 20 minutes and it will be ready. And our matoke is ready. And guys, I've shown you today that you don't have to just cook green bananas with potatoes. You can throw some sweet potatoes, some butternut, even some arrowroots in it. Enjoy this at home. 